Hi, this is a demonstration of industry process automation using programmable switching. So here we are going to automate a simple industry process uh, using this uh, circuit here. So this is nothing uh, but uh, similar to a PLC that is programmable logic control that is used to automate industry processes. So here we are uh, going to demonstrate using these lamps here as loads and we are gonna you know automate them automate these loads using uh, you know uh, the push buttons here so let's uh, start the system see it's working so as you can see on the LCD screen it says press switch start uh, now there are three modes here the automatic setting and manual uh, this is the symbol M indicates the manual mode A is the auto and S is the setting mode here so in uh, automatic mode when we uh, you know, switch it what it's gonna do is it's gonna run these loads and automatically with, our, with pre configured settings and in the, with the pre configured settings you know switch these loads after 10 seconds each so suppose this may be uh, you know the there would be a conveyor belt and the first would be a washer if uh, if the product uh, goes through uh, the conveyor belt first it uh, goes to the washer then you know the painting load the machine or you know the sprayer and packaging one so suppose the product is going through and we switch it to auto so what it does it is it uh, switches uh, all these loads for particular time duration so as you can see first load started for 10 seconds second is again gonna uh, be on for 10 seconds the time is shown here itself the third load and the uh, fourth load now it's showing the timing and duration for each load here just as the switch so again it goes to the first load again so this is the automatic mode uh, now let's uh, check the manual mode here so we have pressed the manual mode in manual mode we have to manually switch on the loads uh, and it shows the status of the loads too so as you can see load 1 is turned off 2 is off uh, 3 and 4 all the 4 loads are off so now let's switch them manually then just manual mode we can you know switch them on and similarly switch them off on pressing uh, respective push buttons so and it also shows the status of the load on or off here d4 is on 3 is on is on similarly 2 is off 3 is off and 4 is off so this is the manual mode let's reset it now let's uh, go to the setting tab in setting you know you can individually configure the time limit for which uh, each load is kept on and for this uh, you know we just have to press the respective load button first then this is for incrementing the time duration so let's keep the d1 for 5 seconds d2 for d1 is for 6 seconds d2 is for Eight seconds. Then D three for three seconds, and D four for two seconds. So let's click the S again, and it starts operating according to our specified time. So you can see 
it's uh, operating as per the time limits given by us so this could be here for 3 seconds and the last one for 2 seconds so this is how we can automate industry processes similar to a PLC through this system here so various industry processes can be you know, automated using this similar to the one I told you uh, suppose the item moves on a conveyor belt suppose 8 seconds are required for the first one for washing then 8 seconds for you know the spraying or printing something on it and similarly this uh, the sprinkling requires an less time so this way we can program the system uh, uh, manually as well as you know switch to automatic and configure it as needed in the particular process and this is how we can automate things using this simple circuit here so this is how industry process automation using programmable load switching works thank you